Some of the fans have been like coming for my neck. Hashtag Team Harper, hashtag Team Piper. I see it everywhere, Piper, if you're watching this. Where's, where's the diss track? Here I am. What did I do this time? Let's fight. She's coming. Oh, oh, that was really scary. Today I'm going to be exposing the drama that's been circulating all around the internet. Or is there even really drama? But that's what we're going to get down to the bottom of today. Guys, setting's a little off. I know. I'm, I'm by myself. There's... There's, there's nobody else. So, guys, I'm completely by, by myself today. Brian, uh, you guys know Brian. He, uh, quit. So, it's just me today, but we're gonna be reacting to everything that you guys have sent me in. So, after this video, comment down below what else I should react to, because I, I really enjoy doing these, and you guys like them. So let's get into the drama, and let's expose what's really going on. Let's take a squat real quick. Alright guys, so the first video, Piper Raquel finally responds to Harper's diss track, not happy. Now, I haven't spoken to them about how they feel about the diss track in a while. I haven't spoken to anybody, not even to Harper, not to anybody, like, what's going on. So, let's see what evidence Anna Oop uncovered. Because it's not a reaction video if we're not watching something Anna Oop related, right? You know, you know, you know what I'm saying? Alright, let's 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 check it out, let's, let's see what, what we're working with. She has red hair, it's like so different. Let's see what she has here. We have this weird photo where she has a ton of pretzels in her mouth. That's cool. Pretzels are cool, look like teeth. What about that girl that you're supposed to fight? I'm supposed to? I'm actually really upset that like a fight never actually happened. I wanted to see like a little friendly boxing match. I think it would have been funny. I think it would have been cool. Who do you think would have won? Piper would have beat her brakes off, G. Really? Yeah. I don't know. Which that's still yet to be determined. Guys, if you're watching this video, spam in the comments right now. Hashtag make it happen. Hashtag make it happen. Alright, let's continue. She did do this whole entire thing about like how like she I need to text her back, which I thought it was like through my actual messages. She had my number, but supposedly it's through my TikTok, so let's see if she DMs me. Look, did she actually listen to it or not? She's scared. She's scared. I did see this. I saw um, in their interview, uh, Harper did a podcast where she was saying, like, she deleted the message so Piper wouldn't see it because, like, she got scared or something. So I'm not gonna lie, Harper shouldn't have deleted the message because maybe, you know, maybe, like, maybe a fight would have already happened if she never did that, but. I checked my Instagram. I checked my spam account. I text. I checked my normal account. She did not DM me or text me, and I would know. And I was like, actually, like, who lies about that? She didn't message on either of them. Oh my god! There's, There's nothing on here. Let's message her. Ooh, Harper. Harper's lying. She's lying. She didn't actually message Piper. <sighs> If you want to text me, just go on and text me. Did Piper Cal just respond to Harper and her diss track? Well, that, that's, that's kind of what she, she just did, uh, Anna Oop. So, so, so yeah, she, she did. Our fans just trying to bait her into responding. Loves, Piper is getting- Dude, I'm not gonna lie, all of you guys, like, not all of you guys, but some of the fans have been, like, coming for my neck. Like, you guys are just, like- so defensive on whose team you're on. Hashtag Team Harper, hashtag Team Piper. I see it everywhere. On I could literally post a picture of the ocean and someone would be like, hashtag Team Harper. I'm like, that's that's not even related. Like, you guys really care, but you guys really want to see this happen more than me. TikTok after her recent video went viral and it all has something to do with her reacting to Harper's diss track. <laughs> These clips make Harper look so villainous <laughs> and so, so mysterious. <laughs> Piper recently took to TikTok and uploaded a seemingly innocent video of her dancing with her friend, Anna. However, the video didn't get the reaction that Piper was initially hoping for. As soon as she uploaded the video, people flooded her comments and they all seemed to have the same message. Harper is the GOAT. Harper- That's what I'm saying! Bro, people, she literally were making videos like completely unrelated to the situation and this, this is what the comment section looks like. Look at this. For life, there's a new queen bee. Harper, all the way. Piper, make your comeback song already. You need to react to her diss track, y'all. I do think Piper should make a should make a diss track back. Piper, if you're watching this, where's where's the diss track? We need we need another diss track. I mean, I'm I'm about to make I'm about to make a diss track with Ham. Also, if you if you don't know who I'm talking about, this is Ham, aka Cole. What's up? So like, I think we should make a diss track on her, and like we should on who? On like Harper. We're going 
crazy! With fans growing impatient waiting for Piper to react to Harper's diss track. Not long after, a section of people even started tagging Harper in the comments. Love. So many people were doing this that it ticked the TikTok algorithm into thinking that Piper reacted to Harper's diss track. So whenever people clicked on Harper's account, TikTok's search suggestion would change and it would tell people to search for Piper's reaction to Harper's song. Now, many people would quick- I wonder what Piper's reaction was to Harper's diss track. I'm very curious. Click on the search bar, excited to see Piper's reaction, only to quickly get disappointed that it was all a glitch. But in my investigation of the glitch, I quickly noticed that most people didn't even know how the Piper and Harper beef even began. So let me take you through the entire- I think Harper just started it. I think on their podcast, someone had asked her, like, who would you fight if, like, you had to? And then she said Piper. And then it just became, like, the world's biggest drama. Timeline of the beef to ensure that we are all on on the same page. Now, one day while they were recording their podcast, Harper was asking a hypothetical question. If she had to do a celeb boxing match, who would she choose? Yep, yep, that's, that's what I said. Quickly answered Piper and loves that clip went viral. Everybody started sharing it and tagging Piper saying that she had been called out by Harper. Harper, if you got the opportunity, would you do a celebrity boxing match? Yes. With who? Piper Raquel. Piper, Piper and yeah, Piper like... Raquel boxing would be wild. Piper. It would be wild. We need to see it. We need to make this happen. Let's fight. She's coming. Oh, oh, that okay. was really scary. By the way, at that time, Piper and Harper had never even met or had any contact whatsoever. Seeing the funny side of this hypothetical question that was put to Harper, Piper made a couple of light-hearted TikToks to calm down a section of her fans who kept on tagging her in the viral Harper clip. After a series of back and forths, Harper revealed that she said that- Man, Harper really does look like a little kid. I think she is. Never mind. A visibly angry Harper even went as far to say that she wasn't interested in being friends with Piper and all she wanted was a fight. Yeah, once Piper doesn't DM me back, I will try to bite her. Oh, yeah. Okay, all right. Are you not scared that she might be like taller than you? No, because I can just grab her by the ankles. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's not how a boxing uh, fight works, Harper. You can't. Uh can't do that. On the other hand, Piper claimed that she hadn't received any DMs from Harper on any of her accounts. Piper said that she had absolutely no communication from Harper. All they had was a series of back and forths on TikTok. Piper then reached out to Harper in her DMs and asked Harper if she was willing to sit down and talk. But at this point, Harper wasn't interested. She replied saying, Wait, nah, sorry, I want to fight. I understand you're too scared to fight a 14 year old when you're 17. Don't worry, we all have our biggest fears. She kind of ate her up there. Not gonna lie, but... Nah, sorry. I want to fight. I understand you're too scared to fight a 14-year-old when you're 17. Don't worry. We all have our biggest fears. Actually, fun fact about me, I don't have a biggest fear. Stop the cap. I'm not scared of anything. I'm not scared of heights, spiders. That's how fearless I am. Bravest man alive I am. Bravest man alive I am. At this point, Harper seemed to have run out of patience because everyone online was telling her that she couldn't win the fight because Piper was bigger and older than her and she worked out every day. Harper seemed to just want to show everyone that she was up for the challenge despite being just 14. This caused people to start calling Harper immature for not wanting to talk to Piper. Just take a look at this more than harsh comment Harper was receiving at the time. Piper being mature for once. Pipe Ooh, wait. I, I I didn't even know about this part. Being more mature and Piper is gonna win because she's stronger. She lifts weights before breakfast or something and Harper is acting more- She lifts weights before breakfast or something. <laughs> Char by saying that she doesn't want to mess with Piper. In my opinion, Piper just wanted to chat and Harper was being salty and saying to fight. Fighting does not get you in life, but this is just my opinion though. I am team Piper because Harper is scrawny and- I, I mean- Piper's just shitting on Harper. I mean, that is, that is facts though. Like, you know, they should have had like at least a conversation or like maybe talked about being friends before just jumping into like wanting to fight. I don't, I don't know. Harper, when she threw that punch, I was dying laughing. Like, girl, if that's how you throw a punch, you're gonna get beat up all the time. Not to mention Piper is way stronger than you and Harper is just dragging it on at this point. Like- I see a, I see a picture of me in there. I think they're, I think she's a, I think she's about to talk about me. Hold on. We are going to fight, fight already. Stop with all this talk. I can just grab her by the ankles. <laughs> <laughs> Our little ankle biter. Oh my god! Oh, oh. That's what I'm gonna do. 
you, Piper, so. <laughs> Whoa! After this, the beef went quiet for a couple of days and fans started thinking that it died down. But boy, were they wrong. The beef had somehow spread. Here I am. What did I do this time? Cash and Gavin at this point. So Cash posted a video talking about how he accidentally started beef between Piper and Harper, referencing that moment in Harper's podcast where Cash asked Harper who she would fight. Now, the next clip exploded as soon as it was uploaded and it caught the attention of Gavin. Ooh, let's see what Gavin had to say. Boy, if you don't- Gavin responded seemingly on Harper's side and basically told Cash that since he started the beef, he should end it. Loki insinuating that if the Piper and Harper thing wouldn't happen, there should be a Gavin and Cash fight instead. Since technically speaking, Gash started the whole thing. By the way, around this time, Piper did action video. My, my thing is though, like, why would I fight Cash? How, how old is Cash? Hold on, let's look up real quick. How old is Cash Baker? He's 20 years old. Why would I fight a 20 year old? I'm, I'm four years younger than him. What? And Harper going through her photos and videos trying to better understand who Piper was. This led fans to start believing that Piper was doing some research before they could officially announce their fight. However, that wasn't the case because both Harper and Piper then did the most unthinkable thing ever and it left the world shocked. So. What did she do? <gasps> so Piper was on her IG live one day and she surprised everyone by inviting Harper to join her live. Oh, how are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm doing great. I'm getting, I'm getting red right now because I'm flustered. Okay, but you look absolutely gorgeous right now. Oh, uh, girls being girls. You look so gorgeous right now. Oh my god, stop it. Oh, you look great. We have some red scarab. I love the way your eyelashes look. They're so pretty. Oh my god, it's red scarab. Uh, yeah. They're being fake. Say that because we're like beefing, but like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's like off, off, offline, like you look yeah, so pretty yeah, right now. Oh, but but like, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, but back online, no. like I'm ready. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're ready, ready, bro. Fans are surprised and excited, expecting to see the two get into a heated argument or something, but that wasn't what happened. Harper and Piper. Wait, hold on, I gotta run that Harper clip back. What was that? To see the two get into a heated argument or something, but that wasn't what happened. Harper and Piper and. Yo, Harper, are you good? <laughs> Super nice to each other. Loves, if you didn't know them and you happened to see that live, I swear you would think they were just best friends just talking. The live was... Alright, I think it's time we watch their new podcast episode, Exposing the Drama, and we should see what they have to say about it. So let's watch this real quick. Let's watch these clips that you guys sent in. I said, if you had to fight somebody. If. Yeah. Like, we're all gonna end. If you gotta fight somebody, yeah. who would you fight? And I, I said, Piper Raquel. More like Piper get rocked, have you ready to come or something? <laughs> Sorry. I, I was just like, I said, yeah. Um, That's crazy. I, I'm so sorry. Or I, so he said, he was like. <laughs> what? He was like, Harper, if you were to do a celebrity boxing match, who would you do it against? And I said, Piper Raquel. And then I said, let's fight. Yeah, but that's like all good fun. Yeah, it's it, all good like, I actually never thought a thing about it ever since. Me neither. Uh -uh. Yeah, I, then again, they probably said that and had no idea it was going to be as big as it was. Because that, it it blew up. My memory's not that great, but I want to say like two weeks went by or something like that. And yeah. the comments went crazy. I, maybe it felt like, it felt like almost a month went They're by like, to They me, would but... drag Harper, or they, she would drag Piper, something like that. It was, <laughs> it was all of that. Comment down below, who do you guys, who do you guys think would actually, like, let's be realistic, who do you guys think would actually win the fight? Yeah, it was all like, oh, Piper would win, Harper would win, Piper would win, Harper would win. And then I felt like a month went by, but I don't know how long it was once the video dropped because we filmed these like a little behind before we post them. So like a month went by, and then all of a sudden we saw a TikTok of Piper. We yeah. Remember the TikTok? So yeah. Um, yeah. She like posted a video. She posted back. a video about. I'm trying. It was Italy Choppa sound. It was like wait till oh, we yeah. see you walk it down. And she was with her friend, and she was wearing a boxing suit. It was pink with her friend in the back. I really think we need to make this happen, guys. Spam the chat hashtag Make it happen. We need to see a friendly little boxing match. Just a friendly one. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing serious. It was just like for content at that point. But then, while well, we're exposing it ourselves, started getting. All right. So now they're talking about how this started off just as like good, good fun. You know, like content. Very real. And, um... Wait, what happened after that? After we called her? Wait, she you guys took it too far! 
and started commenting. You guys did take it way too far. This was friendly at first, and you guys took this out of, like, you blew it out of proportion. Like, this was supposed to be friendly, guys. I guess you guys are some, some diehard fans. I mean, much love, but chill out. No. Oh, I'm just Piper kidding. Piper made a Nobody video actually taking boxing didn't do classes. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what happened. Piper, so then, after I posted back and I showed TikTok me DMing her and her not answering or her saying, let's fight or something like that, I don't know. Um, then Piper made her YouTube Then Piper video. made her. Piper did make a YouTube video taking, like, boxing classes, insinuating that they were going to fight, but, but but that never happened. So, like, Piper, like, what's, what's going on? It's your two video and was, like, do, doing boxing lessons and stuff. Uh. <gasps> Bro, I, I swear I'm gonna leave the podcast if burps keep happening. So she made the video, she did the boxing lessons, and she was like, she did something about it, and then she ended the video. All well, that. It, you made a fatal mistake. What do you mean? Harper made a fatal mistake. Harper. Wait, what did what did Harper do? Oh. Harper DM'd Piper. Okay, I don't want to. And then. All right, so this is already stuff that we've already heard about, but guys, I think the next steps from here, I think you guys spam in their comments, hashtag make it happen. We want to see a friendly fight. Like, we can't live without this. Like, this is something the internet needs to see. This is something that needs to happen. Obviously, if it doesn't happen, that's completely fine, but we would obviously all like to see that. But what we can make happen a lot easier is you guys getting your freaking tour tickets. Guys.